Congratulations! You have made it up to the last unit of week 6. Of course, this week's and the final assignment probably still are open and need to be done. But now you are able to handle the basics of programming. You know all about variables and assignments, about control structures, data types and whatever. You are able to structure a program with functions and on a bigger scale you are able to use libraries. In the last videos we have shown that not now the doors are open to start real programming projects. So what is your next project? I hope if you wanted to get a basic understanding of programming you have achieved this goal. But maybe you have been become fascinated with programming and now you are looking for more. Then the world of programming is now open for you. And programming is not work, programming is entertaining. It is like solving a Sudoku or a crossword puzzle. So, and maybe it's even more interesting. So think about your next project. So what could be a challenge for you? Maybe to uh, access an open database? Or have you ever thought about implementing your own web crawler? Or how is about diving into the big world of machine learning? So a first step would be that you look maybe for more exercises. This usually helps you to sharpen your programming skills and also helps you to understand how you formalize a problem so you can solve it using a Python program. And a good start here could be the advent of code. This is a competition which takes place every year before Christmas during Advent time. You will get a new exercise day by day and uh, people from all of the world are competing. You can find the old competitions there are still open so you can start solving the exercises. The difficulty range is from medium to difficult but you will always find hints in the internet. So, maybe have a look there. Before we finish, I have two more things. Firstly, I would ask a favor. If you haven't filled in the questionnaire for our research project, it would be great if you could do so. There was a questionnaire at the beginning of the course and there is now a questionnaire at the end. If you fill in this questionnaire, it greatly helps us with our research project. And in addition to that, we would like that you give us frank feedback about the course. Please turn to the I like, I wish section of the course and tell us what you have liked, but also tell us what were the issues and what needs to be improved. If you want, you can also request additional courses for the future which might be developed by OpenSAP. So that's it from our side. Thank you and bye bye. Thank you from my side as well and bye and hope to see you somewhere.